If you see a little girl that looks like Kaylee, to pick up the phone and report it. This is Dave McDaniel at Kaylee's grandmother's house. She believes more than ever her little Kaylee is out there somewhere and that an alert stranger could make all the difference. Look at who has her, and if you feel so compelled that that's Kaylee, go up there and say, ask her, are you Kaylee? Where's your Cece and JoJo? While investigators refocus the investigation, Cindy Anthony is more convinced than ever that a babysitter became so enamored with Kaylee that they're together somewhere. And imagine being touched by her and hugged by her on a daily basis or even a couple times a week as a babysitter. And if that love grew to some obsession, someday that obsession just snapped. And when Casey entrusted that person with that child. Anthony believes her daughter kept quiet, hoping her babysitter would reconsider and bring Kaylee back until weeks went by and hope dimmed. Then Casey got arrested, accused of neglect. I think Casey knows who has her and has known from day one, but for some circumstance, she feels that she cannot trust the authorities with that information. If Cindy Anthony could send a message to her granddaughter. Kaylee, you know I love you dearly, and if you see me on TV, go up to that TV and say, Cece, I love you, I want you back too. I love you very much, darling. I know you're going to be with me very soon. And joining you live now at the grandparents' home, we talked to sheriff's investigators again about the theory that maybe the babysitter did take off with little Kaylee. They're saying until that little girl is found, any and all options as far as their investigation are on the table. Reporting live in Orange County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.